Hi guys, this is Ike from Ike'sOutdoors.com. Today we're going to be doing what's probably the, been the most fun review to, uh, to date, just to start out. We're going to do a review on Wild Man's barbecue sauce, and uh, we're in his rub too. But, uh, what we've got here is I've just, uh, we've got some back strap that we cooked out on site, outside on the, on the grill, and a little bit of chicken, and uh, some of it's got this rub on it, and some of it's just got salt and pepper on it. And we're just going to try all this different barbecue sauce out and uh, see what we think of it and see how it goes. But uh, I didn't want to do this review on my, on my own because, you know, if there's one thing I'm really, really picky about, Tyson, what is it? Barbecue sauce. Barbecue sauce. I'm really, really picky about barbecue sauce. So um, <laughs> we'll tell you the story on that one of these days. Yeah. But <laughs> so I brought in the panel of experts here. Uh, these guys are all on my uh, are all on the Ike's Outdoors Pro Staff. Uh, we got Chucky here. Chuck, Mitch, my brother Jody, T Mac, and my wife's back here with her back to the camera. So the what we're gonna do is basically just sit here and um, sample some of this stuff, and then we'll, we'll just. Uh, talk about it after we're done eating and tell you guys what we think of it what our favorite is and what we've uh, what we like and what we don't like uh, what we got we've got hot uh, peach we got peach and my wife loves the pineapple hickory I've tried the hickory it's, it's pretty good and uh, pineapple we got a couple of bills of pineapple and then what's the other one? mango mango we got mango too so mango. and then we've got <laughs> some of this spice rub that we put on some of this stuff too so uh, that's pretty much it. Guys have been sitting here waiting and I'm just going to like, tear into it now. So. Let's eat. One pig waits on another. Yeah, T-Mac's already eating. He's got a damn potato in his hand. <laughs> eating it like an apple. Uh, I know it's probably sweet. Yeah, throw yeah. that back down here and get it. How's it compared to the peach? I, I love that peach so far. Mango's not bad. Sweet, isn't it? That hickory is good too. Sweet. I give the I will roll the peach over the pineapple. Peach. Peach so far is good. Pineapple's good, don't get me wrong, but where's our peaches? And it's made with hundred percent peaches. So Yeah. Everybody knows how I like peaches. I like <laughs> <them>. <laughs> I like <laughs> We have like seen the eat. love of the peaches. Oh man, that but that pineapple pineapple can't go wrong, especially where's the, chicken and pineapple. All this yes. stuff too. Like that thick, chunky pineapple. Mm -hmm. It's got pineapple in it. It's got real pineapple in it. Chopped up, diced up, something tossed in there. But where's the peach at? I think I tried it. It's hard to tell. You jar. may have to grab the oh, jar. Where is it? Oh, that's some good stuff. What's that? Which one? The peach. Mm hmm. I'd say the pineapple's good too, but man, I'd have to choose one. That looks pretty good. You wouldn't think fruit and barbecue sauce would go very well, but it mm -hmm. does. No, I was kind of, when he said he was going to send over the mango and peach and stuff, I'm like, wow. Uh, okay. That's the first yeah. potato with peach. Woo! You're trying to hot stuff? <laughs> <laughs> pretty warm, isn't it? And I'm a wuss. <laughs> with hot stuff. Okay, I got hickory. I got to try this hickory. That's hickory. It's pretty good. good. That's got to be pretty good. It's good. I'm going to see how it goes with my peach. So far, peach has got me hands down. <laughs> you know, I kind of like the pineapple more than I like the peach. Of course, I'm a barbecue loving son of a bitch. Oh, yeah, that's hot. Oh, no, there's a flame. Yeah. <laughs> it's all better than Woo. the barbecue sauce I got yeah. at home. I'll take it right back. I won't name it on tape, but. <laughs> you know, I'm just burnt because nobody else. Because you use crap barbecue sauce. <laughs> hey, yeah. what is it you don't like, Mitch? Pineapple. Really? I like spice in here. Damn it, Mitch, get the hell out of here. <laughs> <laughs> How dare you? Honestly, <laughs> out of all of them, the pineapple is probably my lowest. Except mm -hmm. it went really good with chicken. Yes, mm -hmm. chicken and pineapple. It does go really good with chicken. On yeah. the strap, mm -hmm. but all that chicken was alright. Mm -hmm. That's what I tried it with chicken. It was really good, yeah. but I ate it with this. And, it's and that's like the hickory is good. I think would be good with everything. Anything. The hickory, yeah, is the hickory is good with mm -hmm. all. Of and I'd like to try, and I didn't do it tonight because I wasn't paying no attention. <laughs> but. Uh, can, like after you got it cooked, when it's right before right before it comes off, I'm sure you know how to do this type of thing. But put the barbecue sauce on there and kind of. Marinate it. No, it's uh, right when it's about done, and you put it, put the barbecue sauce Puts on. Puts a little glaze on. Glazes it, yeah. yeah. I'd like to try that with that hickory. I'm making any cook next time. Well, yeah. <laughs> it's still, still really ingredients too. No, no artificial stuff or anything. Yeah. Like 
Yeah, you have like a big bat or something. Well, you know what? Like Everything else you buy, like not like this, will have like red 32. Or yeah. 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 Like, what what is that? You read the ingredients on this; it's all natural. I mean, yeah, no what the stuff that you know? Like red 32. Exactly. Where does it grow? Well, well then they, they got preservatives and stuff in them. Like if you notice these lids. These are like what you would. Uh, That's canning lids. These yeah. are canning lids, exactly. Canning like lids like if we were going to can vegetables. If you go to the farmer's so, market, that's what you're going to see. Exactly. Yeah. Jars like that. No yeah. preservatives or nothing like that. Where Fresh. You get a. You get go to the store and you buy barbecue sauce and it's got all the preservatives in it. Yeah, the How long has it been sitting there? Yeah. Yeah, I'm trying to keep Okay, rub. I liked it. It was good. Mm. It went really well with the chicken. Uh, Pineapple was my least favorite, but it went really well with chicken. Mm. Yeah. Uh, mango was pretty good. Hot. Was, it had a really good flavor, and it was pretty hot. Peach was outstanding. I love the peach. But the hickory, uh, uh, hickory and the peach, man, I don't know. Mm -hmm. They were really, really, I've never had anything like it. Well, it you just really mix them together. I don't know. I probably couldn't take it. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I would just lay in it, love it, and kiss it, and lick it. Yeah. <laughs> like, like, like a dollar a carton. I'd be like, sorry, well, sorry, Jen, you have to leave. I can't know that they're not peaches. But all in all, man, I think just the flavors is just phenomenal. It's just good. Yeah. It's good. Well, I would, uh, I would agree that all of it was good. Not not a big fan of the mango, but I could stand the taste. You know, it, it was it was good. Um, I think a lot of the ladies would probably enjoy those. A lot of the ladies, the ladies. But um, ladies like mango. Pineapple was good. No. Peach out of the three. I mean, who didn't think to put pineapple in barbecue sauce? Mm. It floored me. Yeah. When I, uh, but this guy here, he wild man Bob, has a pretty good thing going. Did some good stuff. But uh, the hickory was really really good. I'm not a big uh, hot and spicy guy. Um, just because I'm just can't stand, can't handle it. But it was still good, and the hickory was probably the best at all. I didn't get a chance to take care of the rub because it was already down. Are you <laughs> <laughs> I had to get a nibble off of the peach. Overall, I would give this uh, this barbecue sauce the whole family he's got going here a thumbs up. Did you put about peach? The peach was great, great. So, what was your favorite, Chad? Probably the favorite. Uh, I would probably go with the hickory. Yeah. Well, I kind of agree with Chuck. I like all of them, and I'm really surprised at the fruit that was in the, You know, whenever he said, oh, we're going to send you pineapple and mango, I was like, okay, wild man, send it over. But that's why why his name, nickname wild man, putting pineapples and stuff like that in barbecue sauce. But uh, I was really surprised. I like the peach, but I like the pineapple better. And I think they're, you guys are right. The pineapple on the chicken will be, is awesome. And uh, the rub, I, I really like the rub on both the chicken and the the back strap. I think my favorite, I like all the ones with the fruit in them, but I think my favorite was, is the hickory. And uh, if the hickory and the pineapple, it's, man, that's a toss up between those two. But I like the hot barbecue sauce because it's, it's good and spicy, but it's not overpowering where you can't eat it. So I like that stuff, but uh, yeah, all the, overall, man, it's just awesome stuff. My favorite is, is probably the hickory, but. Uh, I'm really, really impressed with the, the fruit ones as well. The mango and the, <laughs> the mango and the pineapple is awesome. I didn't so, know you were going to talk this one. Damn good stuff. <laughs> you know, <laughs> fire yeah. up, man. And it, it tastes good on potatoes, too. Baked so. yeah. potatoes. <laughs> Mitch is going to make up. Or Mitch is going to go, I like the hickory and I, and I like the pineapple. <laughs> what do you think, Mitch? I didn't like the pineapple. He really didn't like any fruity stuff. It's uh, just... Sweet fruity doesn't go with barbecue sauce to me, but uh, I like the hickory, really liked it. The spice of the hot barbecue sauce is probably the best. Um, I like hot stuff. I didn't think it was all that hot, but uh, I'm good. over here sweating. I like <laughs> yeah, my nose is running like the falls over here. That's why. I mean, that's why you know you tip different people when it comes yeah. to that hot mm -hmm. stuff. You know, Everybody's got different sensitivities. Yeah. Taste buds. What are you doing now? Mixing them all together? <laughs> trying something here. What'd you think, Daddy? Well, I liked all of it. The fruit was really good on the chicken. I mean, I didn't really like it on the, that part the, on the chicken meat awesome. and stuff, but my favorite was the hickory. The hickory was, unlike Tyson, bathed me in it. And, <laughs> and, you know, just euphoria. It was just, it, it was awesome.
Yeah, you know, and, and that's... I ain't gonna eat the hot, so... <laughs> <laughs> Last but not least, would you, which one do you like? The backbone. I still stand by my, my pineapple. Yes, I do. <laughs> 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 There's a bathroom right behind you. You need to go take a bathroom real quick. <laughs> Give him a minute. <laughs> no, nope, there's so no scraps left. I was just saying that I'm just pretty well to get out. But yeah, I still stand by the pineapple. I liked the peach. It's probably my second favorite. And I'm not a huge hickory fan, but I still liked the hickory. I think it was very good, basic barbecue sauce. The hot, very... I like hot stuff, but i got to have it in moderation, so I can only dip it a little bit in there. But the hot was good. And uh, the peach was really good. Mango is probably on the... The fruit, probably the third one, two of the three. Okay, but uh, yeah, pineapple yeah, is probably my favorite out of all of them. I just like the the sweet and the tanginess together. They really worked really well together. So I that's my the favorite. hickory is just a good all around. It's oh, like yeah. what you're basing. Whatever you cooking, can, yeah. Whatever you're, you're cooking, cooking, you can put the hickory yeah. on it. It tastes awesome. That mango and this peach, or that mango and that pineapple, and if you used to glaze a ham. Yes. Oh, oh, that pineapple and ham. I was, I was yeah. gonna say if you glaze awesome. chicken in that pineapple, that I think that would be awesome. Like yeah. baked well, chicken. Well, see, and I that thought that's what Wild Man says. You know, you can glaze. It's got instructions on here. It says to glaze them with. But I don't know how to do that. And obviously, we weren't paying attention, so it wouldn't work out. <laughs> <laughs> you know how to do that, time? Oh yeah, I do. Yeah, yeah. I do fans all the time. So, see, and that's what I wanted to do. Yeah, is get Tyson up here. What about turkey? What do you guys think about turkey? Turkey. Yeah, the oh, pineapple. Yeah. pineapple on turkey. On turkey. Yeah. 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 They got any type of poultry. I think it would. Yeah. 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 So what do you think? The pineapple and the fruit good. stuff would be really good. I think that some of that fruit would be good on pork chops too. Pork. Yeah. yeah. I didn't think about yeah. pork. Fruit and ham. Ham can't beat that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think that's what I think. The fruit would it would be excellent. Like that pineapple was awesome with the chicken. So the fruit would be really good to me on poultry and ham. And the hickory and hot, throw that on any damn thing. Yeah. Steaks. So, yeah. And that's yeah. the thing is that when it comes down to it, we're all blue collar guys that, you know, meat and potato guys. Most of the barbecue sauce that we eat is hickory. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, that mesquite, yeah. hickory, stuff like that, you know. So yeah. uh, I like the rub on the steak. I think it would, I should have used just a little yeah. bit more, yeah. but um, I just put them all on a plate and sprinkled everything where it was on there and this flipped is, it over, sprinkled it, and put it on the grill. This is pretty much putting the seasoning on there. Yeah. That's, yeah. And that's what I was yeah. noticing. The list of what he's got in there everything is if I'm going to grab spices out of the, the shelf, that's what I'm going to use. It's like, well, pepper, paprika, it's cumin, salt, which pepper. Is the best Mexican yes. style yes. seasoning there is in the world. So Tyson's our cook. Sugar, brown sugar, you can't go wrong with that. Cayenne pepper, salt, black pepper, chili powder, garlic powder. Paprika, onion powder, celery salt, red pepper, and that's jerky yeah. making. That's, that's jerky. what I was yeah. thinking too, because I was thinking the next time we make jerky, I'm going to throw some of that on my jerky. Yeah, jerky would be awesome. The pineapple, I really, really want to try some of that glazed on chicken mm -hmm. on the on the, mm -hmm. now, you know. on the business side of things, these days people have got to think outside the box to make their business grow. Mm -hmm. well, like I said, every, like you run down to Walmart and buy hickory barbecue sauce. Yeah, you know? yeah. I mean, yeah. it's. Probably but even not as that, good as Wild Man. Yeah, that's better than any hickory I've ever seen. Yeah, 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 even just the hickory and the hot. And like we yeah. said, with the hot, most of the hot you get, you, it just overpowers you. you yeah, know, so. it already ain't hardly hot at all. Already, yeah. Yeah. yeah, so that that stuff's pretty good. But And like you said, Chuck, you know, you're not going to run out of, to the store and buy a mango barbecue sauce or pineapple <laughs> barbecue no. sauce and the peach peach you know yeah, just the texture alone you can tell it's 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 home and done that's yeah, it, yeah. That's if you much. look at this stuff which i don't think no the camera will pick it up from there know. but that's kind uh, of like salsa. that is a, is a thick chunky stick, and it would be good for a glaze because it'll oh, stick yeah. on the food and uh it's got real chunks of pineapple in there mm. i mean it's not like it's Pineapple he put a couple drops of pineapple syrup, red number eight, in there or whatever. You know? <laughs> it actually has some pineapple in it. So barbecue sauce and rubs are, are outstanding. Just really, really good. So, uh, Wild Man, we appreciate you sending this stuff. We've had a really good time eating it. So it's been the, one of the most fun reviews that we've done so far. So be sure to check this out, you guys who uh, who are like us, red blooded guys who like to eat some steak and potatoes uh, and uh, chicken and ham and whatever else you want. Uh, that's Wild Man Barbecue Sauce, and once again, his website is uh, wildmanbob.net. Be sure to check that out, and uh, he's got a ton of other really good stuff. I'm sure if um, the pineapple and mango and stuff is this good, I'm sure the rest of it is just as I'm sure the rest of it is awesome. So, really appreciate you guys watching these videos. Uh, be sure to check out Wild Man's um, website. Be sure to check out our website, ixoutdoors.com. 
And Wild Man, we really, really appreciate you sending us this stuff. We get a big thumbs up from us. We uh, had some awesome barbecue sauce, man. That's